Mr. Pritchard, you know the defendant because he is the brother-in-law of this young lady who is either your girlfriend or your fiance, is that's how you refer to her? That's correct, yes. And you have an order of protection against him because he beat you up? Correct, yeah. He assaulted, there's no such thing as being, he assaulted you? Yes. And I know that Mr. Abramson? Abrahamson. Abrahamson, I know yes, that you assaulted him. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Right. And you say you assaulted him because he's a stoner, which I assume you mean he uses drugs. No, Your Honor, I what assault... What does that mean? Well, he is. You been, say he's a stoner who took your sister-in-law, that's this young lady? Yes, ma'am. Down a bad path. Yes, Your Honor. But you called him a stoner. Yes, Your Honor. What does that mean? Well, he smokes a lot of weed. He that's what does I a lot drugs. of drugs. Yes, ma'am. And is that the reason you beat him up? No, ma'am. What'd you beat him up for? No, ma'am. Uh, September 14th, 2015, I had a camera set up in my, my computer room. I have a couple slot machines. Money has been stolen previously from me. So I had that set up, and at the time, it was 8.25. The camera was turned over, slot machine was broken into, money was gone. I came home that day, looked in the slot machine, money was gone. I'm like, what's going on here? Well, did they live with you? No, no, they had to come to my house to get food for at their mom and dad's house. Their dad was in the hospital, so the mom wasn't there. So we had bought them food so they could bring back to the house. Were they living together? I am not sure. You don't know? No, ma'am. Are you sick? I was crying. How old are you? 19. My question to you is, are you sick now? No. What's your first name? Molly. Take a breath. Okay. Don't talk to her. Sorry. Is that your sister? Did you used to live with her? No. Did you ever live with her, Molly? No. Who do you live with now? I live with Josh. Do you work? No. I'm in school. What school do you go to? Minnesota Virtual High. High school in Minneapolis. Do you go to school every day? Yeah, it's online. So you're an online, you yes. don't leave the house? I... I mean, other... No. But you don't go to school? No. And what does Josh do? He is unemployed at the moment. Whose house do you live in? An older lady, she's a friend of hers, like grandma we're living with at the moment. How long have you been living there? Oh, six months, five, six months. Do you get any money for going to school online? No. Do you have to pay any money to do that? No. How do you support yourself, Molly? Uh, boot stamps, EBT, from the county. And how does Josh support himself? He is uh, doing social security right now, disability for his back. For his what? He's trying to get accepted for disability for his back. What's wrong social with Social security. Back? He has, uh, I don't, I'm not sure he would have to explain it. Like, What's wrong with your back? I have a congenital fusion, Your Honor, something I was born with, a birth defect. It uh, causes a lot of pain. I'm currently on a 10-pound weight restriction uh, ordered by a, a neurosurgeon. Well, there are a lot of jobs you can do without having to lift uh, up not, 10 pounds. Not in the county that we live in, Your Honor. There's not much to go on. And the only job that I had going for me was the casino. And thanks to Mr. Abrahamson, I, I can't work there. Molly, do you think you're doing well with Josh? Yeah. Do you? Mm-hmm. You think that that's the right trajectory for your life? Yes. Do you? Mm-hmm. Okay, sit down. Do you see your sister at all? No. Because of him? I'm sorry? Because of him? Because of, yeah, because of Matthew. So let's get back to the slap machine that was broken into. Sure. And I assume that what you're going to tell me is that it was your belief that yes, the your plaintiff Honor. stole yes, your, Honor. your money. Yes, Your Honor. Tell me how you came to that conclusion. My son, he had to come home from school to get some a picture for him. They had pictures that day. And he witnessed the car pull in at, um, what time was eight, it? Do you want to? Stand up. The time, Tell me your name. Aiden Nolan. Tell me about the day that the slot machine got broken into in the house. The money so was taken. I went to school that morning and I... Uh, Where was your dad? At work. And your mom? At work. And how old are you? 13. So you were off to school by yourself? Yes. And what happened? I got to school and I realized that I forgot my picture form. And then I went to the office and said that I forgot my picture form. And they called my mom saying that he forgot his form so he can go get home and go get his paper. What did you need the form for? To get my picture taken. 